Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mary Lisa and you're watching The Girl Miss Yarn. Today I have another of the videos that I've been enjoying a lot making every month, which is the roundup of the new patterns that have been published this month, November 2023. So if that is something for you, then keep on watching. <laughs> Before we start, I want to do a disclaimer because it's 7.01 in the night. And I usually record these videos early in the morning when the light is at its peak. These lights are all over the place today, but I wanted to have this video up. Um, actually, we have construction on the, on the side of the lot of my house, so it's banging all day. Okay, and um, right now I'm tired and I'm hungry and I don't know what's going to come out of my mouth, so I apologize in advance if I am a little unfiltered. I try, okay? <laughs> I try my best. And also, I want to apologize because I have not been here this month, but it's because I've been a little crazy. Um, I went to Seattle to see my oncologist, and then Thanksgiving, I had friends over for a week, and you know, also the courting, and then I want to finish it, I didn't finish it. You know, I've been human this month, so I apologize. But as always, I am looking down at my computer and I have my iPad right here so I am not ignoring you or looking at myself. I am actually trying to be organized for you and um, I'm, we're going to talk about or I'm going to talk about sweaters and cardigans and um, I'm going to probably give you my honest opinion because, <laughs> because of the time so buckle up. with uh, New Traditions by Annie Lupton. This one is uh, sizes 1 to 7 or 36 inch to 73 inch chest circumference. This one is $8. It says here that it's DK, but she used a worsted weight yarn, so I don't know. Uh, knitted uh, bottom up in the round and uh, it has a couple of inches of positive ease. Um, it's, it looks relaxed and boxy and she actually uh, described it as that. Um, I think I, I have seen I've seen this and you know after a couple of, of these roundups you kind of kind of pinpoint uh, people aesthetic as Aesthetic. I cannot say that word. Um, and uh, Annie has this uh, easy, rustic, vintagey kind of look to her uh, knits, and this one is spot on. If you want something that is looks super complicated, I bet this is. I don't want to say complicated, but you know, um, kind of design. Um, this one is kind of cute, actually. Well, I may get. I don't know, because there's a lot of cables, <laughs> but it's very pretty. Um, moving on to number two is Apothecary, the phonics today, and at 8 p.m., almost 8 p.m., 7.25, they're getting, they're getting really thick. <laughs> but this one by De Petite Knitter um, is done in worsted weight yarn, $10, 10 sizes. I think it's from 35 uh, inch to 70 and it has 4 to 7 inches of positive ease. Knitted top down and it says here that you can customize the length of the body and um, the sleeve which I mean hello. If you don't know you can do that. <laughs> but it was written on the pattern so I'm just like give it to you like it is um as um the previous uh designer this one has the same aesthetic the same kind of vibe to her um and she said that she actually knit and um designs this with things that she gets inspired and um around her and um i love this color work super simple super feminine super cozy looks cozy and it looks like a hug um uh i love it <laughs> i love it um we had in between this one and the one that i talked about before one sweater that i missed last month and that one was kind of like a halloween inspired it has um you know color work and it has some uh cats around it and it was so cute and um she has even a pattern for her bunny and I found a pattern that she designed it for like a little donut for 
Fiona, my cat, is happening. He's happening. But um, super nice. She used that yarn that she had on her hands, uh, which is the Let Lopi. I don't know. But um, I mean, so cute. Moving on to Big C sweater by Brie Miklosik. I'm not gonna hope that I might butcher that name. I definitely butcher, okay? Like, it's done. Like, there's no hope. I did. This one is knitted in sport weight yarn, 10 sizes to fit as chest 40 to 70, 8 to 10 inches of positive ease. Um, it's $9, and, and this one has a lot of warnings uh, this uh, pattern before you buy read the warnings because it remind me of the trigger warnings of those morally gray dark romances that I like to read um, this one has if not more warnings it's like if you cannot <laughs> follow the charge don't you even try to buy this buy and then you know complain email me complaining <laughs> but pretty much there's a lot of warnings on this on this one this one is top down and she used it uh she used a hobby yarn so you know affordable i love it i love that it's quite oversized and i think uh, if you're big chested or small chested or if you have a little bit here and there extra oomph uh, to you this one will be perfect to all types I love that you have a little party on the top, but it's not too much. It's just like a get together instead of like a rave. So it's just like a little something, something design, but it's not all over the place. So definitely love it. I wish it was two tone, but you know, we can only hope after those warnings. I don't even want to talk about it because I can't get cut. But next one is the Wildberry sweater by Tonji Hotnet. And again, no hope that I actually Aaron weight seven dollars extra small to 3xl uh, sizes is color work it's so beautiful I think the possibilities are endless and you guys know if it's a spot is it is a line I am in <laughs> like if it's a line this one, I am into it. So pretty. Um, I think you can do all colors or like two colors. She has three here going on. Um, I like the lightness of the background and, uh, you know, the it pops the, the dots. But you can do it in the reverse. So that would be cute. Or like I said, you can do even like, can you imagine like a bunch of colors kind of like Christmas lights? Woo! Love it. Okay. Moving on to the Charles Blouse by Johanna Gerrish or Colibri by, jo uh, by Johanna. This one is done in fingering, uh, extra small to 5XL, $8. This one reminded me of the, what was that? The Face Sweater by September Knits. I love that one and I actually started it, but I couldn't like work with one strand of mohair maybe i can do that again because back then i was like a little you know my hands were like this but this one is the same concept um this one has um pearls going on to mimic the stripes and then you have um the mohair this one is done both colors are the same one but you can do all kinds of combinations and because it's one strand of mohair it's a little citrusy see through so sexy it has a v-neck i love the you know um balloon uh sleeves although i don't know yeah i love it <laughs> i love i love everything about this top down and it's a raglan so you guys know you guys love your raglans that's all you see all the time raglan top down or bottom up like there's no pieces Nobody is catering and knitting and designing for me. The one that like actually to piece stuff. But let's <laughs> next one is the Nikki sweater uh, from Lipool. This one is eight dollar done in bulky weight yarn, four sizes extra small to, or small to extra large. This one, um, it's a younger designer, and let's admire the legs. I mean, I wish I can wear this. Again, I used to buy 47. But let's talk about the sweater, which is what we're 
highlighting here. I mean, at least I keep it together. Um, I love this sweater for some reason. I love it. Um, this one is um, voluminous. It looks really trendy. It's a basket weave stitch and it's knitted bottom up. So it looks like it's gonna be fast and in, in black. I will be wearing this all winter long. New designer. We're gonna just do like that. Next one from the same designer, Magic Checkered, $8, bulky weight, extra, extra small to 7XL and hear me out hear me out why is this a scene here when i started to read through all the descriptions okay um this one is done in pieces i know i you're screaming i know you're screaming i was doing the same thing however i remember when i started knitting when i was like well when I started crocheting because I started knitting when I was like almost 40 but when I started crocheting I started to do like little pieces and even when I would start sewing I will do like little square stuff if you have a new knitter that want to explore you have like a your little um I don't know like your little grandkid that you're knitting and she wants to knit as well just let her like teach her or teach him whatever you know how to do squares and then a couple squares there well, was a lot of squares but you know what I mean perfect if you are a beginner if you want to do a sweater I will if I was eight years old learning how to knit I will do that one I know that's that was long and with winded okay Kingsland sweater from the same designer I mean do I have to say anything else? Eight dollars, super bulky, extra small to eight eight, eight XL. <laughs> this is something that my daughter will love. And again, if you're a beginner, this will be it. Okay, I love it. I love it. I know. I love it. Everything, but this one, I love it. Okay. Next one, Albar Pullover by the Queen, Sarah Norlin, nine sizes, DK weight yarn, $8. This kind of sweater, I don't know, I've not seen it anywhere, but it's trendy because everybody and their mother are designing this kind of sweater. Out of all the ones that I have seen, and I'm going to show you guys one soon, a couple of, of uh, slides, slides down, I feel that this one is the best um, fit, with the best fit. I think the back was done great. I feel like this stitch is quite defined. Um, what else I can do about this? Uh, top down, work on the round, um, and um, like I said, I feel like out of all of the sweaters are into this kind of like super texture, let's put all the nightmare kind of stitches in this one, sample sweater, this one is the one with the best fit. I know. I do my homework. Have you done your work? <laughs> okay. Next one. Camellia Pullover by Setna Young. This one is light fingering, extra small to 5XL, $9. She said that she got inspired by Camellias. I love it. It's colorway, dainty, beautiful. Use very fine yarn to keep it light. And it's a top down raglan. You guys love it. All that. I thought it was so cute. You can do all kind of combinations. And I love um, that it's boxy it looks kind of like you know with a lot of a lot of positive ease but at the same time it looks delicate and beautiful and um i don't know it looks it doesn't look like it's pulling too much i don't know if it's the picture or whatever but i love it if it's here i love it except a couple <laughs> there's a couple that i was forced <laughs> Yeah, but this one, the next one, Saturn can be pulled over, done in DKY yarn, um, $8, six sizes by Min Young Han. I think I said that right. Um, this one is something, six to, ten, uh, six to 12 inches of positive ease, top down, saddle, shoulders, K 
cables off my dreams. This looks so cozy. It's so co can, you can see this one in all the colors of the rainbow as they are a solid. This is so cute. The color, the lawn sleeves, the cables, the everything. I love this design. Next one is the Daisy Sweater by Solvana Knitwear. This is done in lace, extra, extra small to 5XL, $8. Um, I love that she used a light fingering or lace, sorry, lace, because it keeps it uh, light when it's, you know, that bunch of color work happening. And in this instance, in this instance, <laughs> I need to go to sleep. In this instance, I feel like you have the background is white, but you're running all those floats on the back and they're blue. And I don't know if you can see, it just becomes a different color because those two um, yards are so light that it just kind of like brings that blue forward and it's kind of, it looks like not cream. It looks like a, you know, like a light blue and I love it. All that color work is amazing. I, 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 I don't know about the, I don't know about the floats. Who I saw the other day, she was complaining about a cardigan or a sweater that she bought, um, and it was something like that. It had a bunch of floats, and she was like, "Why is there?" I'm like, "Because you don't know that you're not an editor." Okay, Dita sweater, and this is written wrong. Hold on, let me. Well, I'll fix it later. Um, by Rika Orum. This one is $9. Aaron Wade, extra small to 3XL. And this is the same thing that we saw from uh, Sari Norland. That um, kind of like sample all, all the stitches. A lot of texture. However, I don't... This one looks more rustic. And then some of the pictures on the back uh, look like it has a little bit of fit issues right here. Maybe, I don't know. It's just what I can gather from. There's not a lot of information, of course. But in between the two, I feel like the Sari Norland one was designed fit-wise better. But this one is another one of those trendy ones. So I wanted to have it here as well and bring it as an example of, please check all the pictures because you can see something <laughs> Cardigans. And just start with the author cardigan by Colibri by Joanna, $8, DK wear yarn, extra small to 3XL. I mean, it's polka dot. I love it. Um, this is something that will definitely be in your wardrobe forever and ever. You can do all kinds of combinations. Right now we have a light background, a pop of color for the polka dots. So you can do the reverse. You can do color. Like, you can do it all. I love her aesthetic because, you know, it looks very um, retail, but you have the bragging rights. <laughs> I blank on that. You have the bragging rights. Like I talk a lot about that. Like why make it a twenty dollars if you can spend one hundred and twenty and hundred hours to make this? But the reality is, when you say I made it, that right there is priceless so this is very commercial something that is going to be forever and ever endless combinations and i i love it it's polka dots polka dot stripes you guys know i am a sucker for it okay the queen sari norland i'm going to be biased because i love her and you guys know how i feel when you have a design and you make it in like you know we're waiting for the panties on this design let me not give you an idea. It's out there. But um, she has a, a sweater version. This is the Billy Cardigan, $8, worth it, nine sizes. And um, I have to be quite honest. Maybe it's the time, but it's, uh, it's it looks like a nightmare. It looks like a nightmare. It's, uh, it's a lot. It's done top down but you're working back and forth. And there's a lot of charts and the bag is, it was, it looks, it looks, it, it's not, it's not for me. 
Okay, Fiona and I, we're done, right? We're done. Okay, last one. Death Day Cardigan by Rebecca Klo. This is $7. DK Wear Your Own 10 sizes. This is um, all proceeds from this design goes to the Peace Tula Foundation, and she's going to match the donation. I think it's going to be 5,000 pounds. So great uh, pattern to support. I said DK Wear Yeah, yeah, I did. I said all that. Um, she actually said that if you have a bunch of minis, uh, skeins, use, seriously? Relax, right? None. <laughs> so, um, she actually suggested if you have a bunch of mini skeins to use it for this accordion. And I think now the advent is coming. I mean, I love this was $500. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, I love you, but no. Okay. So if you have a bunch of minis and you want to make something um, that you can wear it out there, it's not a freaking shawl or hat, this is the one. I love it. I think it's so freaking cute. It's bottom down, size five in needle. It's gonna be a little, you know, but um, it's super cute and that's it. That's it. There's not a lot of patterns this month thank you um i think last month october it was insane um this time not as bad so i'm excited but until next time um take care vlogmas starts tomorrow so woohoo yay vlogmas anyway see you guys soon bye